It was a short-lived victory for the federal government on Texas anti-immigrant border buoys. One day after U.S. Regional Judge David Ezra ordered removal of 1,000-foot bundled series, Conservative Fifth Court of Appeal Court issued an emergency stay. In decision, panel of New Orleans-based referee panel did not give a reason why Texas province gave request. Governor Greg Abbott ordered that Bowie's explosion be placed in river near Eagle Pass as part of multi-billion billion dollar operation to prevent immigrants from crossing Mexico to Texas. After Fifth Circuit remained, float may remain in waters Rio Grande, while court appeal evaluates case ministry justice against Texas province. The federal government argued floats were a threat to public security, that it prevented navigation in the river and it damages U.S. relations with United States. In documents, Texas lawyers claimed that removal of floating barrier would be damaged by cartel invasion to state's defense, and Ezra Reagan was called an argument convincing. Abbott's controversial border security initiative is to test the limits of a state's ability to implement the migration policy. Governor Abbott explained that Texas did not ask for permission ISIN for the Lone Star operation that Texas built a floating barrier, wrote. Abbott said he was fighting the case until the U.S. Supreme Court. We will continue use every strategy to distribute Texas National Guard troops and public security associations and secure the border, including strategic barriers, Abbott's office said in a statement at the beginning of this week, said. Immigrational rights activists and Congress Democrats called on the federal government to intervene. Congress member Lloyd Doggett, D. Austin, Abbott's Operation Lone Star increases millions of taxpayers in wasting the dollar of the dollar was a strategy that trusts as a deterrence.